hello everyone so today we are going to add some improvements to this uh, uh, fall and ragdoll and recover from ragdoll system the improvements are uh, when there is a change in the direction character is facing when the uh, after the character is landed on the ground uh, there is a mismatch sometimes there were mismatches between the standing up animation and the character's last ragdoll position so those are the things i'm going to work on today and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me right so in this uh, fall and get up system we have a small problem still the problem is this so as long as the character uh, after character falling now it falls like this uh, now it's okay because character forward is same as uh, the forward direction of the mannequin ended up with now if it changes for some reason let's consider a situation like this see now characters rotates a little bit actually it's not clear there much let me try again the character should no this should also work yeah let me try again it happens in a place if we no <laughs> it won't work here sorry it's really actually it is really hard to recreate the issue Ah, we can try something like this let's add multiple platforms the character will collide with so we can have some character would end up in different positions oh, maybe this would work see Oh, that's the issue I was talking about so how to prevent that happening so the issue is this uh, what happens here is uh, here I'm only synchronizing characters location as it falls down um, as it as the character falls down I'm only synchronizing the location of the capsule but I am not synchronizing the rotation of the capsule so we have to do that too let's open the character and when I when the character go into ragdoll mode here keep capsule attached I set only that uh, location we need to set the rotation also but how do we calculate the rotation um, as we are in the ragdoll mode so let's open the character mesh and pelvis rotation is like this and um, we have already developed a method to determine whether the character is facing upwards or downwards uh, when in the ragdoll mode that's by using these head sockets uh, 
forward actors is set value if the value is larger than zero that means character is looking up otherwise it is looking down so we can use the same method with some additions so here I'll instead of set actor location set actor location and rotation new location is like this and new rotation actually we only need to change the your value others should remain at zero but how do we do that okay from the mesh get socket rotation the head socket which is this one this one and then I can get forward vector here if this one is larger than zero that means character is facing up according to the logic we used here so if the character is facing up that means uh, the character's forward value should be um, we can actually calculate the character's forward value like this get socket location we can get the location of the character's head or oh, actually head socket will also work and we can get socket location location of the pelvis right uh, then forward means if the character is looking up let's say temporary like this forward means the direction the look at direction from head to pelvis if the character is how to undo this facing down that means uh, the forward of the character means look at direction from pelvis to the head and it's your component but I hope this theory would work pelvis this is uh, now we can find look at rotation from head soccer to pelvis and vice versa from pelvis to head socket then we can select based on this condition this is positive means character is looking upward that means direction is from head socket to the pelvis that means first one otherwise second one and 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 uh, we need to we may have to love this also yeah the uh, rotation split love with alpha 0.1 i guess it would work let's see and connect 
Oh, we don't need this anymore. Right. Now let's see. Did it work correctly? Seems fine. Let's move this a little bit inside so we can have some more. I guess it is not an issue right now it is working properly right so I made a little extra setup like this so we can have some more reactions on the ragdoll so let's see see now it is working properly all right so i would like to stop this ep this episode right here and as always project files will be available for the download through the patron page link would be in the description below and thanks for watching so if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patron club so see you in another episode goodbye